Molly tells me that you're trying to add fuel to the fire of your fight with your aunt. I don't know if I can help, but I can give you a tip. Justine always hated my cowboy hat. So I should wear a cowboy hat? No. Let me say more words. She hated my cowboy hat because it reminded her of Trish Stratus. Your aunt always resented Trish for being the face of the company. Trish always got more buzz, more press. Even now, Trish's face is on the side of the production truck, not Justine's. Wasn't Trish also a seven-time women's champion? She sure was. One more than Justine's six championship wins, which your aunt especially resented because before Trish came to WWE, she was a model, so Trish had to learn the business from the ground up. Justine always thought Trish got special treatment compared to someone like her, who worked in other promotions for WWE. What do you think? Is there something you can use there? I'm here on NXT tonight with a big announcement. I'm proud to share that the superstars of tomorrow will be honoring the legacy of the greatest WWE women's legend of all time. I'm announcing the first ever Trish Stratus Battle Royal. Well, the main event is next week. We're kicking things off tonight as I personally honor Trish by wearing this out to the ring for a special match on NXT 2.0, the old WWE Women's Championship. This is the same championship that Trish won seven times over the course of her remarkable career. Even my Aunt Justine didn't hold it seven times. It is going to give me such stratisfaction to wear this tonight, in homage to the greatest WWE legend and women's champion ever, Trish Stratus. A woman who calls herself undeniable. She certainly lived up to that moniker thus far. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Utah, Zoe Stark! I love Zoe Stark's energy and love of competition. Well, there's no accounting for taste, but she has proven it by capturing the NXT Women's Tag Team titles. She calls herself undeniable, well, it's time to prove it. I have every bit of confidence that she will. It's the second generation superstar who's here to write her own story. And from Newcastle upon Tyne, England, the WWE Women's Champion, L. Given her history and ability, it's hard not to expect big things from this superstar. It's not that hard, Saxton. Potential means nothing compared to results. Let's see if she can get those. This is a woman ready to do some damage. Exciting superstars is here visiting NXT. And she brought a vintage WWE Women's Championship to top the upcoming Trish Stratus Battle Royale. It's obvious she's throwing Trish Stratus' accomplishments in her aunt's face. Is it gonna work? We'll see. Oh my god! Stark with some agility. Back into the ring. Jarring European uppercut. The counter. Able to avoid there. It's Tio. Looking for an early pin. Two count. Oh, that was a close call. She's got to be upset that the count went that far. Face buster. 
She's starting to look concerned. She still has a lot of time to recover, though. Left by the turnbuckles. Oh, man! Intercepted the attack with a kick to the face. Fisherman suplex. behind that forearm. Cinches up the arm in a series of boots. Forearm to the jaw. Counter from Stark. She's able to get out of the way. Is it enough? Two. Letting her out of the pinning predicament. She might just be toying with her at this point. She's pushed into the corner. Springboard kicked all the way through the rope to the floor. Momentum's breaking away from her. And you know now she must rethink her strategy. Zoe Stark flexing some muscle for the fans out there. Three. And she saw that coming from Zoe. Could do what she needed to ignite a rally. That's a few times now she's taken a hit up in that region. And here come the punches. Competitors showing how well they know one another. Who knew what was coming there? She isn't allowing that burst of attacks to put an end to her. Snap suplex. <laughs> Zoe Stark off the rope. He goes down low with a basement knee. <laughs> and she saw that coming from Zoe. Go behind, up across the shoulders, into the glory bomb. So he's in dire straits for the win. Two. It's over. All in a nice work. Here is your winner, L. And that seemed like a pretty easy day at the office right there. That's why they call it light work, Cole. Barely even broke a sweat. No longer in someone else's shadow, this wrestler has a bright future. The following is a six-woman battle royal. Making her way to the ring from Newcastle upon Tyne, England, L. Matches like these with talent of this caliber, this is why sports entertainment is in art form. This superstar looks ready to make a statement. A tough lady and a real lioness.
and her opponents. First, from Las Vegas, Nevada, Nikita Lyons. MMA trained at a black belt in Taekwondo at eight years old. Hey, there's another eight-year-old that could beat you up, Saxton. She's a one-woman highlight reel. And from Glen Ridge, New Jersey, Katana Chance. Ah, such a pleasant sight to see Katana Chance. She's always in a fun-loving, good mood. Yeah, a very high-spirited competitor as well. But once the bell rings, Katana needs to get serious. But don't let the big smile fool you. Katana is highly skilled inside the ring and in the air. You know what, guys? I'd be hard-pressed to name a woman with a brighter future, in my opinion, here in WWE. She's proven herself not just as a capable singles competitor, but also a tag team competitor as well. A great young talent with an extremely bright future. And from Laredo, Texas, Roxanne Perez. One of the biggest names in women's wrestling before joining WWE, trained by Booker T. You can't judge her by the company she keeps, but she is definitely living up to her height. You can see the passion for competition in Roxanne's eyes. The very definition of young and hungry. It's WWE's biggest fan turned superstar, Maylee Fan. And from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, Maylee Fanny Fan. Maylee Fan just asked for my autograph. How about you, Saxton? Uh, she's probably just waiting until after the match. One of the best competitors around, ready to show her skills. Time for some stratisfaction. And from Toronto, Ontario, Canada, Trish a true trailblazer in our industry. In fact, one of the first women to main event Monday Night Raw. She left her mark on three decades of women's wrestling. Just when you thought the road to WrestleMania couldn't get any more exciting, Trish Stratus herself has entered NXT's first ever Trish Stratus Battle Royal. Well, there were a lot of fan favorites coming into this six-woman battle royal, but Trish just threw most of their chances over the top rope. Ball straight forward. Brutal 
stomp to the body. And he lands his head scissors. And that was a well-executed attack. His head scissors take down. And talk about an impressive combination, guys. From the middle rope. Oh, she lands hard. Positioning in top rope, heading up there. This is not going to be good. Could be catastrophic. What a superplex. <laughs> On the shoulders of a slam. <laughs> Just carrying the opposition anywhere they want. Do the arena. Can we 
see the attention being put on the torso area. And she's gone after her opponent's core a few times now. should hope to emulate.